As we approach the November 8th general election, Vicksburg Daily News encourages you to learn more about the candidates as we present Coffee with the Candidates. A very special thank you to Daniel Boone, Leslie Silver, and the staff of the Highway 61 Coffee House on Washington Street in historic downtown Vicksburg. Thank you so much for joining me today on Coffee With. My guest today is Alicia Ashley. Alicia, thank you for joining me today. Thank you. I think this is our, actually our first time to meet. We met just a few minutes ago. I appreciate, appreciate you coming out tonight. Thank you. I'm glad now, you asked you, me. Uh, yeah, this has been really yeah, fun, has, hasn't it? it has. um, you're running for Chancery Clerk. Yes, ma'am. Okay, now tell me what is the difference between Chancery Clerk and Circuit Clerk? Because it's all in Warren County, correct? correct. Okay, so correct. I don't really understand the difference between these two, those two positions. Yes. Chancery Clerk normally handles most of the public records dealing with divorces, child custody actions, conservatorships, guardianships, land records, uh, person has a deed, that's where they'll file it. If they need to come find a deed or a power of attorney or something of, of that nature, they, they would come there and we would help them find it. Okay. Um, the Chancery Clerk pays the approved expenditures by the Board of Supervisors. Mm -hmm. um, the Circuit Clerk is, is where your criminal actions are handled, civil actions um, over a certain amount of money. Um, so you know, that's the difference. Okay. Between. And what do you, what do you do now? Um, I currently work for um, two local attorneys here in town. And what made you decide to run for this position? Well, I, my employment, I've been there for 10 years, and 85% and of what I do is through the Chancery Clerk's office. So I, I, I'm there every day. I, I know what they do, and, and when Miss Dot decided to retire, I knew that's what I wanted to do. Well, tell me a little bit about yourself. Are you from Vicksburg? Are you married? Have a family? I have um, actually Eagle Lake, which is Vicksburg. Right. Still considered Vicksburg, but I have been there 23 years. Uh, I'm originally from Yazoo City, but uh, Vicksburg since age nine. So. Yeah. Um, but yes, I'm married to Paul Ashley. We've been married 20 years. I have four children. Is it okay if I name them? Oh, sure. Okay. Uh, Michael, he's 20. Clayton is 18. Uh, Hannah is 11, and Zach is five. You have a lot going on at your yes, house. I do. That's a wide age range. <laughs> well, Michael, Michael's he's, he's out on his own now, and Clayton's yeah. in college, so it's just really Hannah and Zach at the house. Yeah. Except for the weekend. <laughs> <laughs> then everybody's, yeah. especially everybody's you know, back. Especially at the weekend in the summer, yeah. right, yeah. when the weather's warm. What do you think makes you uniquely, uniquely qualified for this position? It's different from other candidates. Who, I, t to me, it's my experience through the Chancery Clerk's office, what I currently do, is it because I, I know how things are ha handled there, what can be done to make things better, because I work there through that office every day and, and what I do, and, and I just, I, this is what I want to do, and I, you know, I want to serve the community, and, mm -hmm. and, and you know, anybody comes in that office, I'm there to help them, that, that's my job, mm -hmm. and to make sure that the people that, that are under me, that they're taking care of the citizens of the community. Do you see any things um, that you think you would do differently if you are elected? Um, not, you know, Miss Dot's wonderful. She's, she's done a great job, Miss mm -hmm. Chancery Clark. She's been there for years and years and years, and she's done a great job. But they have in, um, instituted this new MEC filing, which is where everything is filed electronically. Uh, you know, if you're in an attorney's office, you just scan something, file it electronically to the courthouse. You don't have to hand deliver it anymore. Um, but, but there is a process that they have to do in the clerk's office. They have to enter it in several different systems. And you know, it, it may be electronic, but it's still, they still have to, you know, they have to do it themselves. And they have to do it into two separate systems. I believe it's two. And it's a lot of work. Mm -hmm. it, it's, it's a lot of work for, for one person to do. And it's actually, I think, three ladies that, that do that. But they're back moms, you know, and, and they're having to come in and work on Saturdays and Sundays mm -hmm. to, to handle that because they have so much going on. And if an attorney looks for something in the NEC, it's not there. It's because they have not been able to enter it, you know, and, and it's, it's, it's a lot of work for, for the women that are So are there. you hoping to streamline that process? Yes. Yes. That's, that's what I hope to try to do, mm -hmm. to accomplish that okay. and, and make things quicker. Um, is there anything I haven't asked you that you want to be sure that people know about you or about why you're running for this position? Or uh, A lot of people are, are saying my age, you know, because I, I'm 35. I'm 35 years old. I may be 35, but I have a wealth of experience with, with you know, with every position I've held has been with the public. 
and 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 that's just what I do, and and, and I enjoy it. And so you know, I, I just want to let them know I may be 35, but but I have a vast amount of experience work-wise. Well, you know, there's always two sides to, yeah. to the coin. You yeah. look at that and go, do you know, sometimes it's time to get some youth and some yeah. energy right. and enthusiasm. Right. Not that somebody else didn't have it, but um, new leadership for a bright future. Sure. Yeah. Right. There's <laughs> two ways to look at everything, right? Yeah. Two perspectives. Well, I thank you so much for joining me today. It was my pleasure to meet you, and I wish you the best of luck. Thank you so much, and, and I'd appreciate your vote. Thank you for coming. Promotional consideration provided by Amber Sanders from Happy Hair. Get your hair happy at 3402 Wisconsin Avenue.